All right, so you're not gonna believe this. When I say everybody's beefing, everybody's beefing. Nick Merx, Tim the Tatman, Dr. Disrespect, all of these streamers have been banned by Activision. Not necessarily from Call of Duty, they can still play Call of Duty, but they have been banned from the uh, Activision events. Temporary, is it permanent? That part I'm not sure, listen. But Nick Merx is permanently banned after this one. Like the video if you think there are two genders. Dislike the video if you think there are only 5,000 genders. And when I say everybody's beefing, this is the entire Twitter right now. This is the, the streets right now. Seconds are trying to dox everybody. Seconds sending heaven proposals left and right. And, and the stuff that we have today, it is absolutely wild. People are saying F your opinions. People are saying F being civil. People are saying, hey man, we don't care, little bro. We just want to dox you. We want to send you heaven proposals. Yeah, Twitter is like going crazy with this one. Officer Lucky responding. We got the quad ring out here making videos on the situation. Needless to say, it is a crazy, crazy event. This only happens once every year in June, apparently. I guess you guys are not ready. Roll it. Uh-oh, one of the world's most popular Call of Duty supporters has come out seemingly in favor of Trump. And I'm sure, as you know, the internet is probably totally taking it as a normal disagreement. Who are we kidding? They're doxing him, pulling his yeah. financial records, going berserk, leaking his DMs, harassing him, having complete meltdowns yeah. because one random guy said, Hey, I don't buy into your yeah. gender yeah. ideology. This is what yeah, pr pretty normal stuff, right? Like everybody's like, yeah, bro, like pretty normal stuff. How dare you say that, right? Especially in the month of June, you really gonna say uh, that there are only two genders in the month of June? How dare you say that? Yeah, he's getting dogs. He's getting canceled left and right. I mean, he was canceled last year as well, but okay, let, let's wait for Happened it. Happened when you, when you secure the bag like Nick Merckx did, who has yeah. a kick deal uh, and decided you no longer, he no longer will ever have to worry about money. He won't have to worry about sponsors. He won't have to worry about anything. And he said this in an offhanded remark. And the entire internet has been filling their their diapers mm -hmm. for the last two days over this. And he posted this, right? And this tweet blew up. Everybody that has been reposting this tweet is uh, doing crazy numbers because a lot of people uh, agree with him. Surprise, surprise, shock, shock. A lot of people agree with him. But there are a few that don't. And they're trying to cancel the guy. Wait for it. Nick, the transphobe struggling against the trans gay. There's no such thing as trans people. That's something that you created. So have fun with your little dreamland. But that shit's not even real. Let me break it down for you, right? Penis? Dude. Yep. yep. Vagina? Girl. Done. Come in here with that fucking... <laughs> I mean, like... I, mean, I, I don't really think that... You know, you look at some of these replies, right? By the way, this tweet got 100,000 likes. Okay? Sheesh! This is what everyone will- uh, can, can our brother get two likes, one like for each gender, guys? Believed until five yeah. years ago. 5,000 likes. He's yeah. not wrong. 2,000 likes. Oh god, a normal person. Where's the yeah. lie? I'm gonna start watching his streams now. He's 100% right. You can wear dresses, take hormones, you know, do surgeries, but you can no more change your sex than you can change into Napoleon or Mars. Once a dude, always a dude. And that's a good thing, though. Uh, that's a good thing. I mean, uh, yeah, like... You know, you've got a lot of testosterone and you can ultimately use that power and the energy to create like a life force as well as and you can do a lot of things with uh, having testosterone as well. Yeah, once a dude, always a dude. And that's a good thing, man. And nothing, nothing to be ashamed of. Come on, man. Like it's uh, it's perfectly fine, man. It's, uh, and it's of course, okay. the trans mafia, obviously, you know, he's not yeah, wrong. Right. Let him cook. So again, most people, you know, agree with this, but then you get into the mafioso, you got yeah. people who uh -oh. are doxing him, linking his... Now he doesn't live here anymore, so I'm not too worried about it, but... Oh my god, he got a business loan! That invalidates him! Did you guys know that Nick Merckx got forgiven a loan? Yeah, look, looks like the man's UAV uh, is malfunctioning right now, so he doxed the guy, but that's uh, not his right address, right? So he, his UAV malfunctioned. When despite being one of the most successful streamers on the platform... Dude, I didn't agree with the PPP loans, but I told everyone around me that they should get them. Why shouldn't you? The freaking LA Lakers were taking PPP loans, okay, during the lockdowns. I didn't agree with printing the money, but I'm going to take mine. You'd have to be an idiot not to. And oh, by the way, during the lockdowns, you know, you still have to pay your employees. So that's what PPP loans were actually for. It wasn't for people in need of money. Those were the free okay. checks that they were sending out every week so yeah, that okay. people didn't get used to never having to work. 
Guys, if you wanna, before we get down to the climax, if you wanna help support the channel, consider becoming a member. Yeah. So I don't have to take sponsorships and I can put like food on the table as well, guys. Please and thank you, please and thank you, please and thank you. Shout out to all of the, the, the beautiful members, all of you beautiful bastards that are members on the channel, all right? All right, let's get back to the content of Boo. Oh my God, he's DMing, so now we have to leak his DMs. You see this? I don't give an F about you. Save the children, Lamaud. What are you talking about? Get this through your head. Uh, trans so uh, apparently, like Nick Merix also, I'll, I'll show you a better view. Okay, so apparently Nick Merix also sent a DM, or he's responding to DMs right now and, and saying all of that. <laughs> yeah, right. So he went crazy. He took the matter into his own hands, quite literally. He says, "NY double chain retweet the true we what unlucky brother, unlucky brother, buddy boy, fat pom pom bumbo cloud." So. He went crazy. He just ultimately went crazy after he got the deal, after he secured the bag. And listen, I always say this, right? Money is not the root of all evil. Money just literally exposes who you truly are. So if you are given money, you're going to be free. And you're going to say what you truly think. And right now, Nick Marks is saying what he truly thinks and believe. And a lot of people are showing love to the guy. A lot of people respect his climbing uh, uh, up, uh, up as well. A lot of people are saying, yeah, that we, we agree with that. We agree with that and a lot uh, some people are like hey man we don't agree with that hey man why are you saying that bro hey man it hurts it hurts our feelings right so yeah money money is just money is ultimately is giving the guy freedom and now he's speaking his mind and you know what shout out to the guy shout out to the guy one like for each gender this is nothing more than a mental disorder people are le le people are leaking his dms right yeah double chin the trifractor unlucky so he's dming people who are criticizing him and dunking on him and they're so totally unbothered by it that he, they're leaking the dms and right. you have this guy oh again right. all these people are leaking you know fear buck is a channel that he's just an engagement farmer on twitter or whatever but he puts this out <laughs> again fifty five thousand likes this is the normal the regular status for people it's time to start fighting back about this nonsense look I don't agree. Look, you shouldn't be like dunking on trans people yeah. or being mean to them yeah, because yeah. they're trans. There is a very no, no, no. It, it's perfectly fine though. Like, uh, yeah, you want to do you, you do you. Like, uh, uh, yeah, let's not attack anybody for sure. But also, you, you just yeah, like you also don't want to push that crap down normal people as well. So it goes both way, both ways, right? Yeah, we're, we're gonna we, we we leave you. You also leave us alone. Simple as that very small percent of the population that does have gender dysphoria. It's a real thing. But that's very different than trans TM, where this nonsense was, oh, 25% of the high school population yeah. is identifying as LGBTQ now. It's yeah. nonsense. Yeah, like 10 years ago, 20 years ago, it wasn't like this. I, I wonder why all of a sudden, after we have been alive for like, what, thousands and thousands of years, now it's happening. I mean, come on, man, give me a break, right? There's a reason why... 25%, 18%, 17%, whatever the number is. Th there's a reason why it's climbing because they're, of course, indoctrinating kids right now. They're pushing this hard. Every game, every movie is like pushing this stuff heavy. We have been covering that on the channel. Uh, jokingly, sarcastically, seriously as well. Uh, yeah, right? Like, so of course, of course, it's confusing a lot of people. It's not confusing you, maybe, and you think that it's not confusing other people, but sure as hell, it is confusing a lot of people. Uh, uh, especially the new uh, the new generation of course and that's truly what they're after they know that bob out there in his basement or in his beautiful mansion or in his house he's not gonna bend the knee right because he's too far gone you cannot change the guy you cannot convince the other guy right but the new kids on the vlog they don't know any better let's go ahead and uh, Confuse them. Let's uh, make sure we put them in a confused stage because uh, you know if they are confused if they cannot think for themselves and uh, uh, Yeah, like we win right so we can put them towards doing something else after that and uh, We can push like something else later on and guess what they're gonna believe it if they can believe this lie They're gonna believe other lies as well simple as that So they want people being confused and a lot of people a lot of new people new kids uh, on the block they're they're confused with it and people are calling for him to be suspended so nick merck's can say stuff like this and worse on the platform yeah. not get suspended why would you want him suspended oh he's homophobic and he's a piece of ass and y'all still enable him why because he said let's see we have a father's day one day we have a mother's day one day we have march 
Bi Health Awareness Month, March, March Trans Day of Visibility, April okay, one day. Asex Day, June Pride Month. Damn. And he said, give them an inch, and they took a mile to that reply. Uh, it can a brown man also get a month or something like that? Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I want a month too, man. I want to be, I want a month. I want to be strong, independent. Like, like the video so I can get uh, my rights as well, guys. I, I'm lacking rights right now, man. I demand representation. I demand representation. I demand representation. I need my representation. Of course, I'm joking around, guys. Uh, for two people that will take it serious, I'm joking around. F all that. I don't need it, man. I don't need it. I'm not that insecure, okay? I, I don't need it, man. It's madness at this point. What's wrong with that? So basically, Nick Merck sounds like he's a conservative, you know, or he's just, you know, he's not even a conservative. He's just like a normal dude, a normal human. Pronouns in the bio, F and loser. I mean, everything's true. I, you know, again, this is, he secures the bag. So he doesn't he have to crazy. worry about these idiots yeah. canceling him. I have no idea what. Yo, I wonder if like a lot of other streamers, right? Like, of course, Doc has also spoke about it openly as well. But he has, he talked about it like once or twice from what I recall. He hasn't went like this crazy. And, and yeah, nobody needs to talk. I mean, it's if you want to talk about it, you can talk about it. If you don't want to talk about it, you don't have to talk about it, right? Simple as that. Simple as that. Uh, Tim never really touched on it, but he just said that he's going to back his friend. Uh, so, you know, Nick Merck's skin was removed by Activision because he said, leave the kids alone. And then uh, Tim the Tatman took a day or two and then he said that, bro, like, okay, he's my friend. Uh, Call of Duty, remove my skin. He just said that. He just said that. And, and yeah, you know, I, I, I can, a chap like me can respect the guy. So he didn't speak anything on this two genders, uh, 5,000 genders, none of that bull squash that's happening. He just said that, you know what, uh, out of respect, just remove my skin too, because you remove my, my homie skin. I, I can respect that. So yeah, he's kind of like in the middle, but of course he's likely blacklisted from Activision as well. Uh, from, from their events, not in game. A lot of people get confused with in game and events, right? So they're probably not going to invite them out maybe in the future they will but nick marks oh hell no nah. the guy is just a, they permanently banned the guy and i feel like that if a lot of streamers get uh the the bag like that i wonder how many of these streamers are, are gonna also talk about it right because a lot of normal people yeah a lot of normal people don't buy this bull squash that's going down right now absolutely but a lot of normal people i'm sure a lot a lot of you watching the video you got some opinions as well but you cannot say those opinions because uh you know you might get fired from your job and it, it's a real thing and I, I don't blame anybody man i don't blame anybody because uh yeah I, I get it man like you gotta put food on the table and uh for some people they're working at at jobs where it, it life depends on it and it's your dream job as well imagine you <laughs> just casually let opinion uh, casually let an opinion out and you get fired right you know yeah. what uh he got paid out by kick but i'm sure it's in the many millions and good for him he earned it nick Merck shared his thought on president trump versus biden this guy biden is a moron he can't even speak that's why they're really mad nobody is the way he talks is childish and immature no I, I can agree he's better than Biden, I but both need to retire. I don't know about the both need to retire thing. I don't think he's as gone as Biden. But I do agree that, you know, it is hard sometimes to take a president, you know, for real when, when they're talking the way that he the, the, the way that he talks. But look look, I, I st there's a there's a rawness to the Okay, I, I thought that he was saying that it, it sometimes it's hard being a president. <laughs> Okay, listen, I'm not a president. I don't know, man. I, I suppose it's hard being a president, right? But no, he meant to say something else, right? Like, But but it felt like that he was saying, sometimes, guys, it's hard being a president. I mean, no shit, dude. <laughs> the guy, man, he's being real. So fuck it, man. At least, at least, at least you see what you get, you know? The other guy, God, looks like he's fucking programmed. He doesn't say anything up there, bro. He's just blabbering. blabbering uh, uh, I was say, uh... Good impression. Japan... Uh, friends ice cream uh, uh shit my pants pretty good Bingeland? impression actually i thought i was listening to joe biden there of course then it spawned a million again nick Merckx is fine he's fine kick's not gonna ban him for having an opinion kick ba barely bans uh pets for crying out loud kick's not gonna ban him he secured his bag he doesn't have to worry about it all right no. and by the way he's just and, and just so i can point out too here he was only responding to someone who was spitting hate at him just so we're clear right Nick okay, did only? not go out and offer up this opinion unsolicited. Somebody oh, came into his stream and called him transphobic, and damn. he responded to that, mm. which he is allowed to do. Mm. 
Now I don't know what his deal from kickball. Mm, okay, so yeah, that changes the conversation entirely. But it, it yeah, it, like it's damn man. So nowadays you cannot even respond. You cannot even respond. That's wild. Though. I'm sure it's a amount of money that I will never understand or I'll be able to conceive. Okay. How much? How much money? But he's allowed to have his opinion. Can a brother get two pennies? I would guarantee you that many top streamers don't buy into this ideological BS. Again, oh, absolutely. Nick's not yeah. saying to go harass these people or to mean these, be yeah. mean to these people. He's just responding to people. Yeah, who everybody people, man. Love is love, man. Everybody people. Now, okay, honestly, jokes aside, though, like, yeah, like, people are people, bro. Like, some, there are good people, there are bad people. Like, I, I don't view anybody as, like, uh, what's this called? Uh, uh, for example, I, I don't, if, I, if I'm chilling with a guy or a gal and they cool, they cool, right? I don't care what religion they're following, what their race is, whether they're black, white, purple, brown, or LGTV, non-LGTV. I, I really don't give a damn about it, right? But of course, like, like the, the, the push that's happening, of course, like, that's insane. That is, we're seeing the push happening everywhere right now, and it is, it is insane, and everybody had enough, right? A lot of franchises has been destroyed by, by the, by that, and, and it's just absolutely unnecessary, and of course, on top of all, it is confusing the today's kids as well, and uh, all, this, it, of course, like, this has been ongoing for a while now, but a lot of people started to speak against it when it got to the point of, hey, it, your eight-year-old kid or your brother, your little brothers, your little sisters in schools are now learning about this crap. So a lot of people had enough. People like, hey man, our, leave our kids alone. And this happened last year, right? Uh, uh, when uh, Nick Marks also said, leave the kids alone. So, uh, and that's what started, that's what erupted this volcano. And a, a lot of people are not talking about this generally, generally not. I'm not talking, uh, I'm not saying that people are talking about it because Nick Mark said that. No, absolutely not. People were indeed having protests before that too because th this uh, crap is getting down to the kids as well. And ultimately, this is what they want. Like I was saying, if you're like living in a mansion or you're the age of let's just say you're mature i don't yeah some people get mature faster than others right let's just say you're mature and you have the understanding you have an understanding of what a woman and what a man is simple as that men got a pp women don't have a pp okay simple as that simple easy easy let's not even complicate it right if you have this general information and, and you have this belief uh and yeah you're not confused by this then of course you're not gonna buy the sky is green bull, bull squash, right? But a new kid on the block don't know any better. So they're gonna teach the kid that, hey, look, look sky, green, green, not blue, not blue. And, and they're gonna, you, you repeat that lie multiple times and a couple of times over, that kid's gonna believe it. That kid's gonna believe it. Absolutely. Who are That's being mean on. to him. Well, it's another round of transphobic comments. Who cares? Do you guys not know that there's freaking Russian destroyers in Cuba right now? Do you not, oh, not know that our government is stealing billions of our dollars to send oh, to dang. Ukraine or Israel or more billions to Pal? Do you not care about any of that? We care about 0.03% of the population getting their feelings hurt because a complete stranger on the internet doesn't validate their mental delusions. That's what we're worried about. We're living in a most, in the most privileged time in I history. I agree. I agree. That people are getting this butthurt about it and spawning hundreds of articles about this guy saying, look, you want to come up in my stream because uh, and, and call me transphobic? Well, then I'm going to respond in kind. That yeah. person went in there and wanted a reaction. And remember, Call of Duty actually removed his skin from the game because of that. Because all he said was, stay away from the kids. Yep. Remember, that's all crazy, he said. If crazy, we go back a year man. ago, this guy was the darling of Activision and Call of Duty. This happened four blocks from my Overwatch League apartment. America's are, Americans are in a, in a sad place right now. Let people love who they love and live your own life. I agree. You want to love who love is love. Yeah, I agree. But also leave the kids alone, dog. Live your own life and leave the kids alone. Simple as that. Yay. We don't care what you do behind bedrooms as long as you're a, consent, a consenting adult. Uh, do that with other consulting adults. Put your pee pee in poo poo. Uh, put your pee pee in non poo poo stuff. Yeah, wherever you want to put the, the, the pee pee or the poo poo or that. Yeah, that's up to you, right? Like, we don't care about it. But also leave the kids alone. Simple as that. And, and that's what Nick Merck said. And that's what this protest was all about. It was happening even before Nick Merck said that. And, and the reason it's happening is because, like, yeah, people, you know, drew a line. 
and, and they crossed it. They ultimately crossed it. So you gave them an inch. They took a mile. They they took an entire kilometer. They took yeah, or not a kilometer. They took entire entire in the entire planet by the looks of it, or I should say not the entire planet, but the entire west. Uh, the entire west so there yeah so you give them an inch they take a mile that happened they cross the line and now a lot, a lot of the parents are like hey man like leave the kids alone simple as that that that's what's going on and apparently this happened recently as well apparently they actually banned dog as well from not from the game but from the in uh for, not from the game but from the events right check out this video on the screen and i'll see you right there if you already seen it then check out the video on the left bro